Hi friends, now we're going to talk about uh, one major change that has happened in S4 HANA is the introduction of the transaction code SE16H. So let me show you what, what I'm talking about. So if I go to SE16 or SE16N, so I'll show you SE16. So I have a requirement that I need to get all the uh, all the um, workflow creator for the workflow related task okay so here i'm putting this is supposed the template and here and i'll go to settings format place choose fields and here i will just select uh, the creator okay so i have an, uh, i have the requirement to get the unique creator and how many times they have used or something so in order to do that in SC16 and if I just change this to maximum number of list, I execute and I get this all these things. So now what we used to do, you have to take system status, then we have to export it and then we have to in the Excel, we have to do delete duplicate or and then you get the equivalent amount. Now this all this calculation now in S4 HANA, you can do it at one go. How you can do it? So first thing is, I'll show you. I'll go to SC16H, okay? And here is triple W I hex, the same thing, okay? Now what I will do, be doing is here, the, I will do, do the same thing. So here, if you want to see the, see the, 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 the technical uh, field name, you can go here and you will say technical name leads and you'll say this, okay? And here, we are going to first you have the work item creator and i'll just say group by this and here i'll just put the same thing that i put in the previous previous section the task which is this and now if i go down there was another one top uh, w i r h task which is this one top task okay so here i do this and now i will just execute the moment I execute, see, I get all the list, the number of entries, and I don't need to do all these things. So this is a wonderful feature that anyone, any business folks, any technical folk can use it rather than, you know, you'd go to export and import and lots of things. You have to stay in SAP and you can get. So here you can find that there is only 51 unique entries and in that way you can easily find this detail. So this is very, very handy. So that's it. Stay tuned to my SAP channel and happy SAP learning. And if you like it, share and subscribe to it and have a great day.